slate is always really good to use for manifesting and artwork. So, usually I'll find a piece of slate. Hold on. Sorry, I didn't prepare for this. I mean, this part of it. So, I get some slate. I have Bitch Be Gone oil. And whatever surface I use, you know, I put you know, put this oil on. That's interesting. I've never once, sorry, I've never once brought this oil out with me. Helicopter. Who did today? So, so we have our bitch be gone. Now, um, I never do. I don't believe in doing anything against anybody's will. I only do things for myself um, to self protect, love, you know, abundance, things like that. So the bitch be gone is to you know, kind of work with, you know, the other energies, you know, it's the full moon, and so Spirit uh, kept me up last night and showed me what I needed to do uh, for this full moon, for uh, the fans out there who <laughs> won't stop, you know, doing what you do. So, Bitch Be Gone Oil, you can, if you do candle uh, work or whatever, you can put your candle on top of Slate. Slate's really good for the earth element, so, anyway, hope everybody's have a great day. May you be happy, healthy, full of joy. May you love and be loved. So I know it's not very scientific, so what I do when I first get home is I go through all of the stuff that I got, stones first, I do a quick rinse, kind of get, you know, the spiders going the hard way, because all kinds of stuff in my cabinet there, and I'm going the hard way back in the spiders and little bugs that come in. So, first thing I do is I rinse off all of my stones, and then what I'll do is I'll soak them overnight usually. Um, I use Dawn because it's not toxic, and so I use Dawn, and then I'll go through and strain them. Um, hey guys, Anne Marie. <laughs> Sorry the way I look. I've been outside all day, and I'm <coughs> cleaning and scrubbing <clears throat> my stones. And I was sitting here, and I was laughing to myself because I was like, "Gosh, people have no idea the type of life I have. This is what I love doing on the weekend: cleaning rocks, right? <laughs> not cooking them, not anymore." <laughs> Anyway, I'm tripping. I'm on one. Blame it on the full moon. Anyway, and so when I was sitting here, I was like, man, these people who be surveillance of me, they'll see I don't do shit. One minute later, I hear the cat meow, and I just happen to look outside. There's 5-0. Uh, there's a uh, police officer um, in a truck, you know, a police truck or whatever. Sorry, you guys. I'm doing too many things at once. And he's parked a little bit further down from my street, but when I look out side of my door I can see him parked not in front of me but you know um, closer to the main road um, and I was like huh you know and so I noticed it whatever and 15 minutes have been going by and then all of a sudden the cop leaves and I look out my window and he takes off and so I know it sounds crazy I kept feeling like but there's still I, this, I'm not trying to be negative I'm just saying there's still cop energy around I still felt it so I go look out my door. He goes he goes down my street, doubles back around, and he's now up at the corner now, which I think is interesting. I'm not saying it has anything to do with me. However, I do know a lot of people have made a lot of false al allegations about me and been spreading some pretty nasty things about me. And so I wouldn't be surprised. Um, the good news is, is that I'm not worried about anything because... Uh, one, spirit always has me, and two, when you don't do shit, you ain't got to worry about shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm not worried about it, so. Anyway, we're cleaning stones here. And, look at this guy. Oh, you probably can't see that one, because the... It's hard to see on the... Nah, you can't do it. Uh, you can't see the, um, design on here. All of them are really cool. Um... And I handpick each one of my stones uh, for specific reasons and or people that I'm making my uh, stuff for. So 